Good morning, skiers and riders. Sugarloaf in Carabasset Valley. Hope you're ready for a great day enjoying the outdoors. It's time for your latest local forecast and info to know before you go. You can find this and much more at our website, WSKITV.com, including our Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram feeds. For today, not bad. We're looking at mostly cloudy skies out there, so wear those goggles that really show some definition in the snow. We'll see a light west-northwest breeze up towards the summit. Noticeable down here around the base, hardly noticeable. High temperatures at the summit in the lower 20s. And high temperatures down here in the base, right around 30 degrees. But we should see those temperatures falling throughout the day. And they'll continue to fall on Tuesdays. You can see summer temperatures in the lower teens, base temperatures in the lower 20s. West-northwest breeze will pick up at the summit 40 to 65. So be aware of those winds for the day on Tuesday. Could possibly cause an uh, issue with timberline. But we'll see partly sunny skies, which should be great. Mostly uh, cloudy skies as those temperatures still continue to drop up towards the top of the mountain on Wednesday a high uh, or a low of around zero degrees with 15 for your high down at the base that is great for the snowmakers and thursday some morning flurries or light snow 21 will do it for your high 17 for your low up top of the mountain and then friday hopefully the return of sunshine with a high of 24 degrees still good temperatures for those snowmakers birchwood interiors brings you your trail report check them out online at birchwoodinteriors.com 32 trails of ski and ride on five lifts getting to those runs 18 trails are what the groomers got to last night we're looking at some frozen granular conditions over there as you can expect things probably did set up and perm up a bit but the groomers did get out second shift to smooth them out narrow gauge extension bridle chain tote road lower timber line king's landing and hay burner candy side sluice including the head wall lower winter's way the landing and the birches all groomed out snowmaking today starting back up on narrow gauge middle timber line and the landing and make note that the uh, tote road terrain park is closed for a rebuild skidway gets going to get you up and down the landing at 8 30 this morning skyline super quad and double runner east get going at 8 30 to get you to all of the other uh, mid-mountain terrain and timberline that gets going at 9 a.m. for some great views from the top of the second highest mountain in Maine and you can get down narrow gauge extension or tote road extension <clears throat> fat bike trail conditions well do need some more snow uh, the recent grooms on the upper part of the narrow gauge pathway have uh, proved to be rideable as well as a few of the single tracks out there the anti-gravity complex they've got some great indoor activities and the sports and fitness center has some great indoor activities as well but reservations are required Required, which isn't a bad thing you kind of have your own little uh, private Idaho down there uh, as only uh, people in your uh, pod can get together white wolf Inn, they serve uh, dinner as well as lunch on Mondays so check them out up at Main Street in Stratton and Main Street down in Kingfield Carabasset coffee you can order uh, online or just pull up give them a call and they'll have your order ready for you Main Ski and Snowboard Museum, they're ready to open back up for their new uh, exhibit right down on Main Street in Stratton. And if you're looking for a unique gift uh, for your home camp or condo, or need some screen door work or whatnot, some custom woodworking, Western Main Screen Doors right down in New Portland, they'll take care of you. Winter Stick Snowboards down at the bottom of the West Mountain Lift, awesome gifts as well. Some beautiful works of art down there uh, with their split boards and snowboards as well as West Mountain skis. And they've got a bunch of good swag down there too. Be sure to check us out, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And be sure to follow us on our YouTube channels as well so we can get those numbers up and start embedding some of that stuff into our website. But uh, be sure to check it out so you can know before you go, before you head up. Be sure to stay safe, folks. We appreciate it and have fun out there.